In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the manifold nipple on an air compressor. The manifold nipple joins the manifold to the tank. Replacing it is easy to do, and we're going to show you how. Let's get started. Before we remove any parts, we want to drain the air out of the tank, because some of these parts are under pressure. So I'll go ahead and open the drain on the tank and let all that air pressure out. We'll begin by removing the manifold cover. It's held in place with a single screw. Next, we need to remove the hose that runs between the manifold and the pressure switch inside the air compressor. It's held in place with a crimped clamp. Remember, you'll need to order one of these clamps whenever you service the manifold because we will ruin the clamp when we remove it. To remove it, I'll use just a pair of heavy-duty wire cutters, and I'll both cut and rock the clamp side to side until it breaks. And now I'll pull the hose away from the manifold. Now I need to remove the pump assembly from the tank so that we'll be able to rotate the manifold around to remove it. The pump is secured with just a couple of screws, one on the front and one on the back. Now I just slide the pump assembly to the side and I can lift it away from the tank. With the pump assembly out of the way, now I can go ahead and unscrew the manifold. If the manifold nipple remained in the tank like it did on my compressor, use a pair of pliers to remove it. Now we can install the new manifold nipple. The new nipple doesn't come with any thread sealant, so I'm gonna use a little blue Loctite on both sides of the threads. I'll start threading it into the tank side first, and once I have it started, I'll thread on the manifold. And then I'll just continue to rotate the manifold until both sides of the nipple are tight. Now I can go ahead and place the pump assembly back onto the tank and secure it with the two screws. Now I'll reconnect the hose from the pressure switch and secure it with a pair of end nipper pliers. Now reinstall the manifold cover and secure it with the screw.